Hello, my naughty neighbors next door. I'm the five minute gamer. Kind of like that old creepy man that stares at you through windows. Like this guy. Anyway, just want to say hello, neighbor. What an awesome game. And I want to show you guys how to get through Act 1 so you don't get so frustrated when getting chased by that old, hairy, gray, ugly looking man. Like, who likes to be uh, chased around by an old, gray man like that? Besides you, Mom. Mom, I know you like to. Don't lie to me. Come on. Anyway, so at the beginning, you're going to want to load up full of uh, items. One being a garbage can for sure, and then three other items you can throw through windows. Reason being is this game's kind of like a really bad version of real life uh, break and enter. And you'll hop around on the house and you'll need to get into this room over here right off the get-go. Smash out the window with a garbage bag because, you know, physics, whatever, who cares? I guess it's possible. There's a body in there. Uh, flip that switch right there. That switch is important. It's going to ele elevate you to new heights and bring you high up, if you know what I'm saying. Anyways, you can flip this switch here as well. It's not necessary. It just opens up this door down here at the bottom of the stairs, which just actually creates more problems for you. And the old, gray, delicious old man there will just start chasing you all over the place, kind of like a really bad version of Mr. Rogers. Yeah. And he kind of looks like Mr. Rogers, too. And what's that old man's name from, uh, Boy Meets World? Feeny! Yeah, Mr. Feeny. Anyway, you'll see around this corner, the platform, see? Platform's elevated. You're just going to jump across that platform and then, uh, do just a little more break and enter. Get into this old gray guy's house, into his little bedroom here where he has fun with people. You're going to want to steal this key. Now, this key will get you into the old man's back door. Because uh, who doesn't want to be in an old man's back door? You know? No, that just might be what gets me kicked off YouTube. Anyways, that electrical panel might be useful to you later. Uh, depending how you do this, I'll show you how I do this. I take cardboard boxes, try and throw them through windows until I realize that cardboard through windows, even though it's full of stuff isn't the most efficient right efficiency it is not no way anyway you can kill the power at the back here and they'll actually encourage the old man to come running outside how do i know this three hours of losing my life to this uh first level that's how i know that see he'll chase you around the house but because i broke out that back window it's going to give me access to his back door really easy and we all know who doesn't like access to back doors real easy right wife i mean <laughs> oh, hold on. Am I said that wrong? Hmm. Because I think that implies I like... You know what? Let's just go into Mr. Rogers' basement here. So, enter the dungeon. Now we're in the dungeon. This is part two of Act 1, and this is actually very simple, guys. You're going to want to grab these big panels off the wall, or grab a soda can, throw them at the panels, because that is completely pointless but after you realize that's completely pointless you'll grab the panels anyway and then you're on your merry little way reason why you guys need this this game is full of the oh that was simple you know those games full of them you know what i'm bad at those kinds of games yes i am not good at the oh that is simple kind of stuff i overthink i make things super complicated craft dinner turns into a six hour thing for me uh and a simple puzzle can as well i need instructions that's what i need and that's why i'm making this video for you guys okay so you guys don't have to go through the pain that i went through turns out also in this game that uh besides the old creepy man chasing around some of the cutscenes are really psychedelic and stuff and don't worry, I will be doing a tips and tricks video to kind of give you guys that upper edge so you don't have to struggle as much as I did. Also, I will be doing a video that takes real life stories of bad neighbors. I'm calling it the real story. I did one for Resident Evil that was more a factual thing. Uh, this one's just stories from my friends about their crazy neighbors. So stay tuned for that, guys. It could be funny. Uh, also, in the comments, put in your own stories. Maybe I'll do a few of them depending on how many people like it, right? So you're gonna need those big panels because with lots of skill, you're gonna stack them up at the fence. That's what I meant by simple, keep it simple, stupid. Uh, see, there's a fence, looks like you can get over it. Turns out you can get over it. On that side, there's a generator that you have to push the button on. Now, because the magic of editing videos nowadays, I didn't want to put you through the bother of watching me try and 
do this. It doesn't uh, take that long if you know what you're doing. Uh, I'm incompetent at best sometimes. Once you hit that button, you just run around the corner and uh, you can enter Mr. Rogers' uh, creepy hallway. Make sure you're not crouching and run away from him. He's a scary old man. Thank you guys. Please like, share, and subscribe. Tell your friends about me. I love you. You guys are crazy. Uh, blocked hallways, old man. Old, gray, delicious. Yeah, buddy.